Uh, we have new information for you this morning. Police in Tacoma are releasing new details about a missing child cold case. So Brian Flores joining us now with more on this and also getting a look at what this missing child would look like today. Talking about Tika Lewis, this is a case a lot of us remember very well. I was going to say, yeah, a lot of people still remember this case. A lot of people holding out hope that she can be found as well. And for the first time in nearly 24 years, police releasing new information on the Tika Lewis case, including this new age progression photo of what she may look like. Scientists believe that what she may look like nearly 26 years old. Lewis was only two years old when she was kidnapped from the New Frontier Lanes bowling alley on Center Street in Tacoma on January 23rd, 1999. That location, by the way, a Home Depot now. But also for the first time now, Tacoma police releasing this new information saying a maroon or dark colored Pontiac Grand Am was seen speeding right from the business right after Tika was noticed missing. Detectives say the car was a late 80s or early 90s model. More than 20 years later, though, Tika's family continues to plea for the public's help. It's time to bring Tika home. It's time to give us closure. You know, all we want is to know what happened to her. You know, if you've seen anything, come forward. Yeah, Tacoma police say they are still trying to identify a person of interest seen at the bowling alley at the time. Uh, he is described as white, 5'11", with a husky build, shoulder-length curly brown hair with a thick mustache, and also at the time, a heavily pockmarked face. Crime Stoppers offering a $1,000 reward for tips leading to the arrest of this person responsible. And anyone with information can submit an anonymous tip through the P3 Tips app or by calling the number on your screen, one 800 222 tips. Maria.